Hi, my name is Timothy Trespass, and I am a targeted individual. Um, I'm walking on my way to where I have to go today, and I just wanted to show you all the children in their multicolor, multicolored uh, garments, are all doing some kind of chanting sports related school attending socialization something or other and wow although they look like they're having fun right they're all having fun yelling and screaming and whistling and chanting and god i used to hate that so much when i was a child make me put on these silly uniforms and do stuff I wasn't able to do <laughs> and then I would get laughed at and picked on by the other students and the teachers because I was so incapable and recalcitrant and upset and unhappy and completely not in my element. <laughs> like, listen, you know, I went to theater school. I learned to be an actor on the stage. Right. You know, I have no problem costuming and, and taking on roles and whatnot, but <laughs> being forced to be myself as a little kid and put on a stupid uniform with all the other little kids who didn't really like me much and jump around pretending I was having fun just didn't cut it for me. You know, it was a forced a forced um, behavior and uh, sort of like playing pin the tail on the donkey when you're really not into pinning tails or donkeys it's just and it speaks to the, the same thing forcing people to do stuff they really don't want to do socialization forcing them to think a certain way and through their thoughts and their beliefs act in a certain way using feelings as a motivator uh, objects every single object that we come in contact with whether it's a person a place or a thing has a memory has an experience tied to it either a negative memory or a positive memory or perhaps a neutral memory operant conditioning you know things that are normal everyday occurrences are conditioning us to respond to them in certain ways and advertising has gotten <laughs> so neurologically complex that uh, your your every or rather our every stimulation is being quantified and toyed with, you know? Can we find the right key for that receptor to make them eat potato chips until they just can't stop? You know, one thing after another. And, and, uh, well, that's all I really wanted to say. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. God bless you all.